Hello, everybody. This is Steve Grizzetti, co-founder of MoviePicks.com and author of the MoviePicks.com Guide to CyberLink Power Director. And here we are in Power Director. I want to show you a tool that I've looked at in depth in, or at least the basics of it in another tutorial. But I want to look at a little more in depth here and look at some of the higher level features available. If we go to the plugins and we select Video Collage Designer, the Video Collage Designer area is a great tool for creating video collages. That's where you have more than one video on screen at once. And if you've ever looked through this list of collages or these list of collage templates, uh, you'll see it can actually do an awful lot of things. In fact, rather than browsing one at a time, I'm going to click on this button over here and you can see the whole library of collages and you can do as many as was a show here, like six different things or six different videos, seven different videos on screen at the same time. When you do, though, it's going to bog down your computer a little bit, unless you got a really, really fast computer. I usually keep it at about two or three. Three will give you a very nice set of designs. So I'm going to select this design here and click OK. And here is my template. And the templates all begin or end with animations. You can see that by default, from the beginning is selected with a frame animation over here in the uh, collage preferences. And if we scrub through it by dragging this little playhead here underneath the uh, monitor, you can see the animation that will introduce the clips. It's going to come in from the side here and show us clip number two. And then clip number three comes in from the bottom. And that's the template and that's how it will play. We can switch that around here once we add our media, but let's do that right now. Let's go ahead and import media. And very quickly, I'm just going to choose a couple of pieces here, th three of them, in fact, because we're going to have three in our template. And I'll just drag one into that square, one into this square, and the third one into this square. Now, once we've added our media here, we have these options available on the right hand side. They're no longer grayed out, but we can actually add them to our movie and we can choose to put our animation at the end, in which case the animation ends with all of the clips flying off screen. Or we can choose to change our, our options. And again, to make these available, all we do is click the stop button here and these become lit up again and we can make changes to them. We can also choose, as you can see, to turn them off completely. I like them at the beginning. It's kind of fun to see them introduce the clip. And you no doubt have played with these. You can create borders. You can make the borders stronger. You can affect the color of the borders. And there are more advanced settings, which we explore in my other tutorial. But what I'm most interested in is playing with these templates. Now, I have not found a way to actually edit these templates other than by using these little adjusters here, these little preferences in the side. And then when you're done, you can choose save as or share and share these to the director zone. But if you go to the director zone and you can do that when you're, when you've got layout chosen as all, we go right to the beginning. That's one way to get to the director zone. You can also simply select custom or downloaded and you'll see I have downloaded one already. But let's go to the director zone because it's a pretty cool place. So we'll click on the little blue square. If you haven't gone to the director zone, do explore it. As you can see right now, the director zone has 868,000 different templates here. Not These are not all templates, of course, for video collages. There are title templates. There are effects in here. There are things that people, your fellow users, have custom created. And among them here, we have a real nice a set of custom created video collages. So I'm going to select this video collage here. Very nice. And when I select it, if I've signed in and you notice I am logged in here to the director zone, it's a free login and a free space for you to share and take this wonderful library of templates. And I'm just going to select download. And here in my browser, once it's downloaded, all I need to do is click on it in my browser and the template has been automatically installed. And now when I go back here to PowerDirector, here in my downloaded library, I now have design with the orange borders around it. And I can apply that here just by double clicking on it. And now the media that I've added have been changed to include that orange border. And let's see what kind of animation 
just by clicking on the play button what kind of animation they're using they're using the stock animation that came with the original template that they built this one out of so once you customize any template you can upload it to the director's own and share it you can also go to the director's own and do explore that fantastic library let's go back to that library for a moment because i just want to show you once we get back to the library here that just among templates here for the video collage itself we have 417 options that's as of today more are probably being added to this set of templates every day so well worth exploring have a lot of fun with the templates that are available or explore the director zone at every possible opportunity it's actually pretty amazing to have a free library like that now, if you want to know more about how this program works, you want to know more about how this particular um, system or designer works, you'll want to check out my tutorials and tips at moviepix.com and on YouTube. And if you want to know every single thing about CyberLink PowerDirector and all the things it can do for you, you'll want to check out the moviepix.com guide to CyberLink PowerDirector Ultimate. That's available at amazon.com. I'm the guy who wrote the book. My name's Steve, and I hope to see you again real soon. Take care.